Hello YouTube people. So before we get into the video, I just want to say a huge thank you for the view. Thanks for tuning in. If you wouldn't mind hitting that subscribe button, that like button, it'd be much appreciated. Um, I'm just a boy that hates his life, hates his work, trying to do something I like with and enjoy with my life. So uh, really appreciate it. it helps me out. So uh, be and before we get started too, I'd just like to put a little disclaimer. I am not a trained professional. I do this for fun. I'm just trying to build a base on Twitch and enjoy it a little bit more with other people. But do your own research, do your own due diligence. It's not going to be my fault if I lose, well, it's going to be my fault if I lose all my money. But it's not going to be my fault if you lose all your money going off of what I do or anything like that. I am not, and I mean not, a trained professional. So uh, if you don't want to stick around for the whole video, um, the in the center of your screen right here, this is a summary of what I bought today. Um, so if you only watch the 10 second, like first 10, 30 seconds of the video, thanks for tuning in regardless. But this is a quick summary of what I did. Um, it was a little bit of a blander video than my original, my first one, um, just because I kind of, I had it pretty planned out what I was buying today. I didn't do as much research because in my last video, I kind of like went over the individual stocks and why I was buying into them. Today was more just like, bye, 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 bye. And, uh, yeah. Um, another little side note, too, that I uh, bring up closer to the end of the video. I am also buying up uh, crypto, or just one one in particular. Uh, it's called Harmony One. And also with that, do your own research. I am I know next to nothing when it comes to crypto. Um, it's just like, I looked it up. I can't find anything like people dogging it. And, it, and honestly, it, it, that, that crypto is a gamble for me. Like, I, I, I'm, it's only $300 worth, like, almost 30,000 coins. It's like 29,300 or something. But regardless, um, I do bring that up later. But, uh, yeah, you, you made it this far. Uh, thanks for watching, and enjoy the video. And we're live. So, anybody watching this on Twitch? As a vod or whatnot, if you wouldn't mind later on or now, uh, give me a follow. If you're watching this on YouTube, uh, if you wouldn't mind, uh, if you'd like to see more content like this, hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, help a brother out. I'd like to be doing this full time. I hate my life and my day job. If not, thanks for the view anyway. So, a uh, little summary of today. I have $500 more cash of my cash I'm getting thrown into the market, and I've just changed my account to a margin account on Robinhood. <clears throat> so uh, the thing with margin, the I have to keep my average uh, in dividends over 5%. Right now I'm a okay. I just got to make sure that the. Uh, upcoming money that I put into it keeps it over that 5% mark. So, uh, two of the main ones I'm going to be looking at today are uh, AGNC and CenturyLink, both with over 10% dividend. I'm not sure if CenturyLink is still over 10 though. They had a good uh, rally over this last week. But we shall check. Yeah, so right now it's a 9.73. Still a great dividend. Oh, wait. Dividend yield, never mind. It's 8.86 now. I'm at a 10, though. Yeah, I'm up 11% on that. Now, I know it says 25.67, but I have another... <coughs> I have another, like, 150 possibly going to throw into the market. Um, if anything dips good enough. Far enough.
so agency is starting off low. This one I don't really care too much what the price I get in. Yeah, most most stocks, most of the stocks in that I don't really care too much because I'm consistently buying them even when I'm not streaming the week that I I won't be streaming. With the five hundred dollars, I still throw like about a hundred bucks in there. So monthly, I throw about twelve hundred bucks. Bucks in, or will be. So uh, I'm not gonna throw in the full amount that I want to buy in today, right now. But I'm gonna buy part of it right now, just in case it does dip. I'm gonna change the screen just to a uh, different screen real quick. Once I put in the shares. It's on top of all my information. So. Oh, no, my team. The team and one. Wait, would you look at that? Went through. So if you didn't check out my last stream, or my last YouTube video, the reason I, I like them is, like, the principal and the interest is, like, backed by the more, or, yeah, backed by the government. I mean company could still tank, but I mean, just some security knowing that now $2,000 of mine is somewhat safe. See, I'm glad I didn't put the full amount. I wanted to buy up like 1500 to two grand of that, most of my funds today. So I really can't go wrong with these uh, BP, KHC, um, Brookfield, Kraft and Heinz, and CenturyLink. They, I like all three, and they're all paying out a dividend this month. Um, I think with these two, I can't, I really like uh, Brookfield and Hines, but uh, they are slightly under 5%, so I don't want them to take over my portfolio. BP had a great rally yesterday. Yeah, just they've had a great week. And that's why I was like negative, I believe, yesterday. Actually, made just made a little bit of my money, put my money back. Hmm. Keep going down, buddy. Keep going down. I do have level 2 data. I wish I could see that on here. Let's see that on the phone Yeah, there's no way to see it. See, gold.
Alright, let's go and put a unit order in there. Average cost, 3502. Okay, so. Cool. That a little lower. I like how it doesn't even show like the full number, it just says 2.2k. <laughs> so yeah, so hopefully CenturyLink and uh, I'm a bear today I guess. Well, hopefully uh, CenturyLink and EP drop a little bit more. I've been doing a thing with like McDonald's where I uh just whenever I invest I put two fifty into it. I'm gonna start doing that with Tesla too, just uh I don't know, shits and giggles. Good god, it's a two grand now. Not even getting point zero one percent. Good God. Just tanked it. Not tanked it. Yes. Keep going, buddy. I want to see you at forty six. That's where I want to buy back in. I tried to do a couple day trades this week. Didn't go as planned. It wasn't terrible though. I did Kohl's. And it's like Nicolia. It's like an electric car company. Yeah, I'm, I'm glad I sold though. Uh, August 18th. <laughs> That's not my day trade. Oh, that was one of them, but. What would that be? What did I actually even profit from that? It's only like a 20 cents difference. <laughs> so I made 15 bucks. So I made 75 cents on this, so let's just round to 15. And then I lost like, oof, no, I don't care, just see your news. Robin Hood, take it off my screen. Anything? Why 
doesn't say 10 hours though, that's pissed me off. God, this coffee isn't working. I need to wake the fuck up. Hmm. Try not to cuss on these screens. Gotta bleep that out. Bleep it out for YouTube. I want to pick up some more of these too. Maybe, may or may not be the next Tesla. It was a little bit lower this week. I've been following it. But what you gonna do when you don't have the funds? I got right now, 11 shares. I like, I like having like the amount of shares I have ending with a five or a zero. I don't, I hate having just a random number. I like them all being about the same. No, I saw the dollars on the last one. Why has that not went through? Still quantity. I had 11. Okay, there we go. Took a second for it to load. So, uh... Workforce, the one I just bought, they are making electric trucks in my home state. And, I don't know, I read a little bit on the company, I like them. I do not like, however, though, that they play with, or they sell, like, drones. I just feel like that's a very, uh, selective market. So, yeah. I have more faith in their uh, electric cars. The Diamond Peak, though, merged with Workhorse, so yeah, they, their stock prices kind of play off of each other. calculate my like average dividend right now. Okay, so Right now, I have 
have Sentry Link, 33 times 0.25, 25 cents a share. I just want to make sure I'm staying above, like the, like, I want to be making it, since I'm using margin, after I pay Robinhood, I want to be making about 2 to 4%, preferably more on the 4% side, so, just want to make sure I'm sticking with that. What's up, Austin? How's your morning going? A little early for you. Freaking early for me. So CenturyLink, I'm making 825 with dividends every quarter. Uh, AGNC, I'm making 1935, 24 uh, every month. So. I'm a little tired. I think I'm doing this wrong. Oh, well. Well, you know how I think of it, too. So, all right, so I have two, I have half my portfolio, including the margin, in A, G, and C. So, with that one, it's like 12%, I believe. At the current price, maybe it's like 11. Used to being on here on my phone. There we go. See, right now we're looking at ten percent dividend. So, with my half my portfolio, this might be a little confusing, but with half my portfolio being this, even if all the other stocks that gave me zero percent dividend, I'm still making enough alone from them to pay Robinhood back. So essentially, it's still, still worth it because I'm using their money with other shares, and I'm paying them back. So, unless I lose all their money, then that's a whole other issue. Oh, it just makes me happy to see I can spend that much. I feel like a fucking tween at the mall, just like with just a credit card, buy whatever you want. <sighs> Thank you, Daddy Robin Hood. It's gonna keep going down. I may buy this later. I got about another half hour to 45 minutes on stream. And I gotta go run some errands. Because mm. I really want to throw like another five to six in here and another 200 in, into uh, BP. Ford's kind of like a slight gamble for me. 
I, uh, like, yeah, they, they don't have a dividend right now, obviously, but, uh, I do think they're gonna have a little comeback, like, with, they're one of the few already established car companies that seem like they're preparing to dive headfirst into electric cars, and I, I respect them for that. Hate their vehicles, but I'll invest in their company. Shoot, there's another company I want to look at. Had on my mind this week. Can't be too important. Oh, fun. Yeah, let's see. Let's check on them today. Oof. That's not what I wanted to see. Yeah, I would have loved to have bought, bought in right there. That's my bad. I forgot all about them. That was, that was originally, like, last night my first goal was, like, check in on uh, Cedar Point first. You know what? I don't know. I'll get a slight small position at this. I know I'm gonna like instantly move, lose money after this. Maybe not. Maybe it's not even probably gonna go through now. When you keep touching 20. Fill it. Fill it. What's up, Rich? Rich Mazi. How are you doing on this wonderful morning? Hell yeah, it filled. I know, like, the title and the amount of my portfolio don't add up. That's because I'm using margin. Nothing much. Are you investing by chance? Your most recent song? Yeah, send it to me, man. I'm listening to music right now. I'll throw it on. What kind of music is it? If this gives me a virus, I'll hate you forever. <laughs> I like your little album cover, The Wolf. Seems like you're getting good feedback. Are you on 
Spotify, buddy? God, I keep spelling it wrong. Yeah, no problem, buddy. I like it. Really do. If I could spell your name right, I'm looking you up on Spotify. There we go. I don't know if, I don't think this is you. No, only on some SoundCloud. That stinks, man. You get on Spotify. What does it take to like get on Spotify? I don't know how SoundCloud looks like. I want to click it. I don't know if it's going to turn it off. What's the most liked one? You got something good going, buddy. Definitely keep it up. See, I told, I told ya, or myself, instantly gonna lose money on this. CenturyLink is kind of, kind of recovering a little bit. Long term, I'll double it. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I'm just trying to make a quick buck off of Cedar Point. It's just, I wish I would have bought in, I don't know if you were watching earlier, but I wish I, th earlier this week I had the money, or I guess it wasn't a week, a couple weeks ago I had the money to buy in here, but it was like in between pay periods. Alright, where was I? Alright, so that right there is going to make me 20 bucks in 8 days. Because 25 cents a share, right? Yeah, it's a quarter. So yeah, 20 bucks on the 28th. Dividends. I actually think I'm going to hold off on BEP today.
Do you have any recommendations, Pro Chief? Here. I'm gonna look at the last photo you sent me. If I remember right, like, all yours were, uh, a little bit lower dividend. I want, like, over 4% dividend stocks. What's up, buddy? Going on a hike? Yeah, that sounds like a, a fun day. We could have done it tomorrow, because as of last night, I had it off. But uh, I decided to flex a day off. She wanted just a random day off. We decided to work a Saturday. <sighs> yeah, well, I... I'm the only one with the day, the, what I'm trying to say is I, I'm the only one with the day off tomorrow, she, she has to work. God, I like that guy's music that he, like, put in the chat, but, uh, that last one was making me a little anxious. for the rest in the agency. Ooh, they are dipping. I just buy in at thirteen seventy six. Rainbow six. Easy way to find out, buddy. Let's see. Okay. Handle that. It's definitely can handle that. Yeah, I can do that. But you know what? You know what's better than Rainbow Six Siege? Way better. I, I can't. I can't even believe you're playing that with this new dope ass game that just came out. You're really playing that, bro. You should be playing Fall Guys right now. You have Fall Guys. I have yet to buy it. I need to buy it today. I keep seeing... <coughs> <coughs> I keep seeing people playing it. You love it so much. Is it cross-compatible? Like, if I get it on my PC, can, uh, can we play together?
Yeah, it's cross compatible. At least I think so. Oh no, heck, heck, man. Uh, yeah, no, I really want to play it. I want to get it on Mariah's computer and mine. So... I'm trying to see how much margin I have left. Because it's not accurate when I push one of these. It's just, when I push one of these individual stocks, it shows how much they all allowed for that one stock. So I have $342 left. We're going to spend it all. Every penny. I don't know, do I throw up more, the rest into a gamble, or something safe? Because, like, Cedar Point and Workhorse, I wouldn't mind throwing in into. Or do I, since I <clears throat> am using margin, do I want to count on that dividend? I really thought this was going to dip today. I hate how it legs behind not updating like the price or how many shares I have. There we go. You know what, Prochi? You had a good point. I'm gonna double my money by next year, so. Let's do it. transfer like another hundred some bucks transfer to Robin Hood hundred start with a hundred whoop whoop instantly in my account Yay, 
I'm just debating on turning my drip off for a couple of these. Because, like, do I really want it to get thrown back into craft? Like, agency I'm keeping. I want the drip on that. I want that to just keep building and building. Sentry link, I'm right there, too. But, like, I think I'm going to turn it off for BP craft. Yeah, BP craft. Shoot, everything else is non dividend for now. Just get those dividends and put it into agency. So that's about where I wanted both of these. I wanted BP and uh, craft to be about the same, like equity. You know what? Let's make this an even grand. You know what? Let's put a limit order in just for 11 bucks. See if we can get lucky. Um, so for an even grand, I need... Well, actually, just... Yeah. Oh, not even. Already making money on it. And I'm out of coffee. Darn. Heck yeah. It's only 2%, but still. All right, well, I'm going to give it a second, see what uh, all happens in, like, the next five, ten minutes. I'm going to go get some more coffee, put in a little ad break, and I will be right back. Stay tuned. And I'm back. So something exciting I just saw. I uh, <clears throat> I inputted everything into my dividend tracker, and I am ninety nine. I'm making ninety nine cents a day. I know it's not a lot, but <clears throat> I'm gonna meet my goal today. And by the end of today, I wanted to be making a dollar a day from dividends. So. Mission accomplished. Almost. But uh, my Century Link ended up going through. I think I might make it at even 100. That's, that's a nice dividend I'm about to get be getting 25 cents a share. Pretty sure. So they were, uh, even after they pay it out, pay the dividend out this quarter, they, uh, they were still making money, so. So BP, just doing a little quick summary of, uh, what I'll be getting this month. Two 
use that to share. And what is crap? Let's just do it. Let's go ahead and uh, make this an even hundred. Okay, now we're right through. Recommendation to. Uh, Anybody new? Always do limit orders. Market buys will screw you. I thought it said it went through. Oh, it's just place. I thought it said it fulfilled. Never mind. And to anybody that might be interested, um, all of my stocks I've been buying up, just, I had Ripple and Harmony and, uh, two different cryptos. And, I don't know, I was really liking Harmony, so right now I have 29,366 coins of it, which, I mean, sounds like a lot, but in reality, it's only three hundred dollars worth, but, uh, yeah, I keep buying that up in the small portions. The only thing I don't like about it, and it's either my bank or the crypto.com that I go through, but they keep charging my, because they're based out of, like, Britain or something, they keep charging my, uh, bank like a foreign transaction fee and it's one percent and it's getting really annoying entry what's that for uh i need to take that off that was for when i was doing a little uh giveaway and i was having people enter with their eats so sorry you had to waste your eats to ask you just asked <laughs> Got me Century Link. We'll get we'll get a couple extra pennies from me. Just I want this to go through. There we go. Now you see it said purchase. Not placed, it said purchased. Oh come on. Okay, I just got a notification and went through. Sweet. I think I'm going to throw the rest into a gamble because Fun and Ford both had dividends. They both nixed it with this whole uh, epidemic going on. And I'm pretty confident that, like, they'll bring it back. No clue with Ford. They they nixed theirs with the last recession. Um, so, I mean, it could be back into this year or the next year. Fun, I really don't think they're going to bring their dividend back until next year. Because this this has got to be a terrible year for them. Because they are solely they're they're an amusement park, 
uh, company. Like, they own a bunch of different amusement parks, but, uh, <sighs> yeah, they gotta be taking a huge hit from this. Hey, you know what? Well, this just shows you I am not a professional. <laughs> just, I was just saying how oh, I'm definitely gonna lose money on this today. I'm up. Yeah, I forgot to put the little disclaimer at the beginning of this. I am not a professional. I'll make sure that's there on my YouTube. I did a little clip in. Just do this for fun. broken on what I want to do. Oh, I guess I'm only working with 47 bucks? Okay, that one's 63. See, this is what I'm saying, like, different stocks that limit to you what you want, what you can do with margin. Let's go and get another thing of BP. Shares, limit order. Yay, a tank. A little bit. Yeah, keep going down, buddy. Going down. And that's what, I still have some extra money I may throw in later this week. But for all purposes of today, this is all I'm at. This is the last of my money for today. Take my four cents. Looks like I only have a buck I'm working with now. Yeah, because, okay. So since that had it limited, it's going to limit my margin. And I use the rest of it. But yeah, guys. I know it was a little bit quicker of a stream than uh, my last one. But uh, there you have it. Through $2,500 or over $2,500 into the market, and uh, like I said earlier, it's not showing here just because, like, over a little over 2k of it was on margin, so this is just my actual money right here, so, since the chat is kind of dead and whatnot, I am going to be heading out. But, uh, yeah, bought up some BEP, uh, Craft, Agency, and CenturyLink for the dividend coming up this month. And after buying that, I should be at a dollar now. Let's, let's just double check. After the CenturyLink buy in the BEP, I should be making a dollar a day now. So before I throw a wet, throw a claim out there like that, let's just, let's just double check. And my grand total a day from dividends is a dollar oh two. Fallen. <laughs> ah, someday I'll be making a hundred bucks a day. 
But uh, on that note, thanks everybody that tuned in today. If you want to recap, uh, catch the VOD or uh, follow me on YouTube. And uh, yeah, hope you guys all have a great day. Love you too, buddy. Peace out.